Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Today we are watching Riverdale season 4, episode 14. And Riverdale's back last week. We don't have a Riverdale episode, so I'm just excited for this one because last week ended with Barry killing Jughead, and that maybe that's what they want us to believe. But Jughead have a plan, yeah, right? So it's part of their plan, I hope. And I think it's their time to mess up with their minds. With the, you know, those kids from Stone Old Prop. So, we'll see where this goes. This one's titled, How to Get Away with Murder. Which, by the way, I watched the show, How to Get Away with Murder. And uh, I, I finished the entire season one. And it's available on Patreon. And soon it's gonna be available here as well on YouTube. I don't know when, but... I, I completed the season one of How to Get Away with Murder on on Patreon. It's all right there. So yeah, yeah, I'm just excited for this and let's see on um, what they insert for us in this new episode of Riverdale. Um, uncut version of this is on my Patreon. If you want to watch me watching Riverdale for 40 minutes straight, you can head into my page. Links of that is in the description below. And yeah, let's just start this. Here we go. My iconic beanie up in smoke. No. Driving back to Riverdale, they didn't say one word to each other. They should have. They should have gotten their stories straight. I got coaxed into an intense game of strip poker at that stupid Stonewall prep party. We all went skinny dipping in some preppy stole her clothes as a prank. Oh. What are you doing up? I had insomnia. Are you okay? No, I don't. Is Jughead really yeah, dead? No, everything's fine. Is that blood on your bra? <laughs> no, relax. It's red wine. Underage drinking in the middle of the night. <laughs> it's Riverdale. Naked. No, I wasn't even <laughs> drinking. I. Whoa! I love that. <laughs> That's the thing about murder. You gotta have the stomach for it. Especially if all signs point to you having committed it. Toga I keep thinking we should have called someone other than Charles. No, Charles was the right call to make. He's no. an experienced dealer. Char <gasps> Dead bodies. As a matter of fact, yeah. He's an expert. Without him, we would all be in jail. Right no, Charles is bad Did we? idea. Well, Did she we didn't know that. That has to have been their plan. They wanted me to be caught red-handed, standing over Jughead's body. We have to take them down. What's happening? We cannot let them get away with this, with what they've done. Betty, why would they want to murder Jughead? Yes. What's up? Can Catch I join you? Yeah, we're kind of in the middle of something right now. Catch you later. Uh, yeah, of course. Damn. Archie, that was exactly the wrong thing to do. Wrong with the musical? Have you decided what you're doing? Oh, yeah. we're gonna have a musical this season. We were catching up, and of course, I told her about your situation. What situation? Oh, with school, oh. colleges, <laughs> and she thought, well, we thought that we might have an idea. But I can't take this. There's only so much pretending I can do. Ooh. Sorry to bother you, but I haven't heard from Jug all morning, and I'm starting to get a little worried. Have you talked to him? <laughs> just like a party last night. Sure, she wrote it all down. It's just like a the script. The only thing I can think of is that he went somewhere to write. I know he had to finish a draft of his novel. How was that? Damn. You did exactly what you would do if you hadn't heard from Jughead for a few hours. Last thing I remember was him saying that he was going to meet up with you in the woods, which <laughs> I assume happened. It didn't. He did say he wanted to talk to you, though. I'm saying you and I went into the woods together. And then what happened? Oof. Mm. Don't you remember? So he's aware. Interesting. Shut up, Brett. <laughs> well, I'm sure he'll turn. <laughs> Let us know if you hear anything. Oh, We're this busy. game they're playing. Oh my god. Watch where you're going. Yeah, back at ya. What do you think happened? I don't know. Maybe she had an episode. <laughs> an episode? Come on. Archie. You didn't see her sophomore year with Chuck Clayton in the hot tub. She went full Sybil. She thought she was Polly. Yep. For a minute Remember now. that. Oh my god. 
Oh, Evelyn. Hello, Evelyn. It's nice to see you again, buddy. Oh, Riverdale. Oh, fudge. How's Jughead doing these days? Oh my god. Oh, I'm already in hell. <laughs> Not yet. This is hell where they keep all the boyfriend killers. Fuck you, Evelyn! I don't know what's real and what's not anymore. Brooke's not just my friend. She's my girlfriend. Oh. Your what? We hadn't really been close since college. Oh, and then really? We connected after her husband died in Afghanistan. Mary? I knew it. I kind of felt something, you know? I need, I need you to go to Stonewall and start a fight with Brett. <laughs> what? I thought we were supposed to be laying low. I mean, we didn't see them. Of course it was them. Who else would it have been? Y you. They're thinking that it's you. Brett! You killed Jughead! You killed my best friend! Archie, you're done! I called campus security. They're on their way. I suggest you go, or the police will be next. Ponytail herself? Oh. Uh... How stupid do you think we are? Oh my god, they know. Bye for now. <sighs> you're so infuriating. It's okay. They're smart. Oh my god, this is. <laughs> Crazy. I need to take a breath. What is. Oh my god. Is Chuggit really dead? What is happening here right now? I just, I'm still kind of in denial, but. There's gonna be a twist on this at some point, right? So. Yeah. Yeah. Chuggit's alive. This is all just. Hello? Stop talking, Archie. Tell your mom that everything's fine. But that you have to go. Say it's about Veronica. End the oh my god. <gasps> Do it. She's now. just watching by the window. That's so creepy, Betty. <laughs> I understand, Veronica. I'll be right over. What the hell are you doing with my missing son's phone? Ho ho ho. Ho ho ho. Snuck it into my pocket when I was at Stonewall. To mm, make that girl who bumped you put the phone. Oh my god. I really couldn't really understand why people don't don't feel that something's just put in their pocket, you know? I mean she's your family. Sisters. Okay, dead. You know what? I still don't believe this sickness. I think Hiram's just doing this to keep, to keep Vernica in a line with him. I don't know. We'll see. Just got a call from a hiker. I found a bloody rock in the woods. <gasps> the place where the stone wall party was. What? You didn't bury it? The preppies must have known that I would get rid of the rock, so they must have had a backup one with Jughead's blood all over it. I'm sure my mm. friends are on it too. This is crazy. What's move, do you think? I really don't know what's going on. If Jughead's that's, yeah, that's just my main concern. And can I ask what prompted this review? Now my application is under review. I'll give you one guess as to where that call came from. The Stonies. Who else? Oh, your dad? We're in a war. <laughs> yeah, Betty's war. Find yourself back in that place. And then exhale. You wanna hear it? It's a drug. Commonly known as Devil's Breath. It's, Devil's it's a potent breath. drug that blocks certain neurotransmitters affecting one's short term memory, much like a blackout. The history of mental illness. The perfect murder. No body, no crime. Oh my god, they need now what? to take now? down these kids from Stonewall Prep. They're just insane. Jughead becomes one of the Stonewall Five. Donna thinks she's got it all figured out. And in a way, she does. Every move that we make, the preppies make a counter move. One that pulls us down deeper. Body needs to be found by Sheriff Jones, not by the FBI. 
it has to be him. Oh my god. Is he really dead? He's really dead, right? Oh my god. We're gonna have to resurrect him. Bring him to Greendale. Man, all of this is tying up. These are all the end credits. Fudge. This is really crazy. Oh my god. He's really dead. No, no. This is... It's really him. Oh my god. I'm just What is that? So sorry. I don't know, but somehow I still don't believe it. There's no way they're killing It's Riverdale. This is, she's gonna, he's gonna come back to life. <laughs> we just bring him to Greendale where pe people don't stay dead. <laughs> oh my god. This is insane. Is Jughead really dead? That is just the question. I don't care what's ever happening. I just want his Jughead is really dead. Well, we saw the body, but for some I don't still, I still don't believe it. I don't know. Oh, fuck. It's not fair. Jughead's still alive. It's part of his plan, right? Maybe it's just the story he's writing. And if I'm going down, you better be damn sure I'm taking you down with me. <laughs> but I am the ultimate wild card. <laughs> I am the daughter of of the yeah. Black yeah. Yes. The and now she's proud of it. <laughs> I'm training with the FBI. Not Jonathan. You. Not even Brett. You. Donna. Just you. You're gonna regret ever meeting me. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> Is Chuck is really dead? Uh <laughs> For them to make the next move. Oh my God. Oh my god. <sighs> Whew. Man. Man, this episode is crazy. Really crazy. So Chuck is dead. Whatever. We're still not believing it even though there's body and we saw his dead body and dead and oh my god to be honest I love this game that Betty's playing you know with the gang against the stonewall prep who's gonna make the next move and Betty decided to take the unpredictable move and have Sheriff Jones found a body oh my god Jughead's corpse of oh, this is crazy. A lot of things is happening, but my main concern is just about Jughead. There's no way that they're killing him. There must be a twist. Knowing Riverdale, there's gonna be a twist right here. If it turns out that all of this is just Jughead's novel, you know, that he's submitting to the Brotherhood, and maybe that's it. I don't know. But Mary told Archie that she had a she she's got a girlfriend, Brooks, you know, and they love that. And Archie told Mary as well. And they kept trusting Charles, which is not a good idea. Oh my god, this is insane. I just wanna know what's what's all of this. Jaga got a plan. She, he told Betty, she's, he's got a plan. So when he said he's got a plan, he's got a plan. And there's no way that those... I don't know. 
but yeah 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 i'm just excited for what's to come on riverdale and to know what exactly is happening what's going on and uh, i just can't wait to watch more of this show i just love this so jargo guys this is riverdale season 4 episode 14 Teen, how to get away with murder that's the title let me know your thoughts about this one in the comments below and hit the thumbs up button if you love and like and enjoy this reaction of this show and full version it's on my patreon if you want to watch it you can head into my page links of that is in the description below and yeah i'm just so so thankful for all of you guys for all, for all of your support and thank you thank you for watching for more reaction videos just click here to subscribe